What's up? My name is Ryan. Shit. And today we're gonna try to figure out who the fuck took a massive dump on the fucking servers today. But in my opinion, it was a good dump. You guys might have a hard time figuring out what was posted on this update because nothing is said on either Reddit or Realmai. And I've tried to gather as much footage as I could in 30 minutes because I'm busy eating shit. And there has been a breach in the realms. A glitch has happened. And I had to make this video so William 12 year old beta male had some point to criticize me on. Uh, and by the way, it happens whenever you type lolly. FBI, open up! And since Realmai isn't really that useful, I've tried to figure it out myself by playing the game for the first time in one week. And if I don't have any pictures or cover or forget to do something, it's a human error, okay? You can just uh, leave it in the description and I will make sure to heart that shit in comments so people can see. I'll just quickly have a moment of appreciation to Manual or Doom Butcher on Discord for the $10 donation on Patreon. We'll first take a look at the stuff that you might be interested in. The glitch in the realm. Step 1. Someone calls it. It will now go through a bunch of different phases and drop some confetti on the floor. I don't know why you would celebrate this stupid update, but either way, I have left a link for Hyperion's video in the description if you want a more in-depth explanation on every single part of the phases. A dungeon has now appeared with the name The Machine. You're now up for quite a boss battle. Decker, just a tip, don't make dungeons when you're drunk. But I'm actually really impressed by the Decker team that they managed to pull this off. I'm not sure how long. They worked on this, but it doesn't seem like something that would only stay around for a couple of weeks. It's it's a good dungeon, it's a decent boss battle, it's not like Ant-Man crawls up your ass and expands dungeon, but it's it's alright. Now what is the price of defeating Null? Let's go through the whites, and after that let's look at the reskins. There's the Mace Murderer, a vanity item, really good feed power and these really weird shots. There's of course the Kit Force weapon. Look at those shots, really practical. And Jesus, that feed power. And the most useful quiver in the game, not even better than the rest of the golden archer set that has been added. I managed to get my fingers on the butter bow. Five shots, really unique. The good part about this set is that the fame bonus is really high. Good for suiciding. And the regal ring, I mean, look at that. Just look at that. Such a pretty sprite wasted on a joke. They can't keep making these joke sets, right? This is probably some sci-fi reference I don't understand, but Mr. Mango is... Uh, well, it's, um, it's a dagger. Thanks for Lil' Cold for providing these pictures, by the way. It just shoots mangoes. I really want this item. Then there's the Blade of Ages, which literally takes ages to fire. It took 12 seconds for this goddamn thing to even show. Whose idea was it to make a katana look like a broken boner? Probably the same guy that resprited all these items to make them puns. Also, if you don't get any white bags, the boss drops either mystery stat pots, maybe some skins of some sort, and also this fake energy potato. Now let's have a look at these puns, shouldn't we? Prepare for extreme laughter. Dagger of the malevolent fool. <laughs> Wand of redundance. Staff of the Cosmetic Hole. It's ironic because these puns make me want to punch myself in the dick, so thanks for that. And yes, I'm afraid there's more. There's of course the Leave Bow. I'm, there's no laugh track for this one. This is, this is a serious issue, these puns. I have a serious problem with these puns. Why? And they made the Decker Ring the Ring of Overwhelming Health. And they just made 90% of the sprite into that health texture thingy on the ring. Nah, I'm kidding. These are good puns. Uh, uh, guys, guys, this is brilliant. They made the Oreo into the chocolate cream cookie. And the same around. It's genius. It's wordplay. Nothing can compare. With this come as of now, Bakuribox12 just uploaded his update video. God damn it! Why does he always have to steal the show? Okay, okay, I'll be the one that talks about the items then. Now let's leave it at that with the resprites and let's think about the patch fixes because there's something really interesting about this. At first, in this Reddit post, we see that the Ninja ST set I was talking about in my scrapped content video has been released and it was on testing for recently and it has now been officially added. There is a new ST mystery box that you can run if you want to get these items. I will leave a link to a more sophisticated description of the items on Bikuri Box 12. The new April login calendar is, uh, well, it's disappointing. 
And the new skins, they're, they're fine, they're fine, but not that's not the important thing. Now, they uh, they fixed a bunch of shit, and uh, I can't help but notice that they fixed the quiet running ninja thing stuff. And I goddamn hope I wasn't the reason that they removed it. All cubes are now spheres, but they still count towards cubes, because they're still fucking cubes, so don't lose your friend of the cubes on that. Holy shit, that was a lot of cubes. But we also got some event reskins. It's the usual ones. Cool Shrine, Robber Dog, Hermit God, the Sphinx and the Sphere God. Sadly, not this reskin. Rilma is updated according to the bosses, so you can go check them out. And you will finally become rich on April Fools because they fixed the vault. All the brown bags are unopened vault chests. Two new PPEs and an NPE is coming your way soon, and you can shit yourself for the next one. Shit!